Hi guys, Ray2179 here, and today I'm going to be doing a redstone tutorial on the piston elevator. Um, now, I know three different designs of the piston elevator. Uh, two of the designs work off the same, um, use the same method to get you up. Um, these two designs are the normal design and the zipper design. Um, these two um, piston elevators I do not like to use because they are somewhat unreliable. Um, they um, work uh, ba they work by using a bug that was in Minecraft 1.3 and 1.4 uh, that allowed pistons when they are pushed into the bottom half of a player to like move the player upwards by one block. Um, this bug still works in 1.5, but it doesn't work all the time. Um, sometimes if you uh, push a block into the bottom half of a player, they may be pushed down. It's a very rare occurrence, but sometimes it does happen. And that's why I do not like that design, because it's somewhat unreliable. Now, if the pistons went a little bit slower, then that would be possible. But there's no way um, to make it go slower without uh, ruining the entire design. The zipper uh, design works off the same bug, uh, except it just... Uh, moves the blocks into the player from the sides. Um, but I'm using a third design that I always use. Uh, it's reliable and um, fast, I guess. Um, this design is the tornado design. And now, I know this is the oldest design that exists, and it seems like it wouldn't work anymore, but it works just fine. Um, it, the wiring is not that hard either. All it is is it powers the piston, which pushes you up the stairs, and it goes to the next repeater, which is on two ticks, to power the next piston, push you up the stairs. Next repeater on two ticks, power, push you up the stairs. And yeah, it's very simple, and that's how it works. Um, you can even set all the repeaters to one tick, but be careful when you do this, because uh, one tick makes it go extremely fast, and after a little while, the... Um, after a little while, the pistons will get ahead of the player in terms of speed, and... Um, once they do that, the player will get stuck. So um, at a certain time, I think it's about maybe 40 blocks up that this happens, um, the player uh, might get stuck. So you have to watch out. What did I do here? Hold on. Oh, wait. I need a block here. There we go. All right. So uh, anyway, let me show you uh, this thing in action. Just walk in. So, uh, try to stand as centered on this block as possible and push the button. There we have it. It's taking us up. Here we are. And here we are at the top. Uh, keep in mind though, you cannot move, uh, you cannot push any of your arrow keys or WASD, whichever controls you use if you're right handed or left. Uh, you cannot move the character um, while you're in the elevator or you will get stuck and you also you can move your head around uh, with your mouse but you can't move the player uh, you can't walk around while you're going up otherwise you will get stuck um, if you put it to one tick it goes quite fast but again sometimes you get stuck because of the speed um, alright so uh, let's build this thing so in my inventory I have what we will need uh, we need redstone redstone repeaters um, this is like one of the only uh, redstone tutorials that I've done aside from the TNT cannon that does not require a redstone torch so that's pretty neat uh, redstone redstone repeaters uh, sticky pistons I'm gonna be using blue wool and red wool um, any block you want glass that's just for the tower it also can be any block you want and stairs any type uh, so let's build this thing so first what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a uh, square out of the glass that is four by four just like that um, and then we're gonna break one hole right here for the opening and just kind of build like a doorway kind of around it and make the walls higher so that they match height with the doorway top of the doorway now uh, we're gonna put in our first stair which will be facing this way so as you walk in go to the back and to your right and face it that way then we can put in a couple more stairs um, yeah so next what we're gonna want to do is we're gonna put uh, red wool there blue wool under it oh also you will need a button I prefer to use wood I just I don't know why just for piston elevators I like wooden buttons you can use either stone or wood whichever you prefer um, and we need a sticky piston facing inwards right there uh, pushing the blue block so yeah 
Next, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take power from this. Uh, eh, there we go. Uh, in redstone. So now we push the button. Gets us up the first step. Um, then what we're going to do is we're going to put in the next piston. So stand on this stair. Break out that one. Blue hole there. And place the piston touching... Oh, facing the blue wool so that it can be within reach of the blue wool and then all we need to do is bring this up by one and over repeat it right next to it two ticks and like that but this is basically all you have to do the entire way up so I'm just gonna do a few more and uh, show you guys um, that's really simple just repeat what I just did for every single one uh, just out to up one and to the side, two ticks, and redstone. Also, you need to put a block on top of this piston so you can continue the pulse. And that's all there is to it. Two out, up the side one by two. Uh, just put in the piston, block, two ticks, redstone. So that should get us up the first few steps. So let's try it out. There we go. It works fine. Uh, also, we can put this on one tick, and it will go a lot faster. But you guys remember what I said in the beginning of the video. Be careful, because once you start getting really, really high, uh, the pistons will get out of the player. It works fine now, and I know that looks really fast. It's really efficient. Um, but if you're going to make it one tick, if you want it to be that fast, then you can't build it too high. Not much higher than this example I have over here. Um, because after that point, the one tick starts to be too fast. So, I'm just going to build this up a little bit more. Um, just to demonstrate that this does work long term. Um, and I like to build the outside. It doesn't have to be glass. I was about to say glass. But it doesn't have to be glass. Whatever material you choose to build the outside out of, um, that's what you can use. Um, just going to build this like so. Then we're going to go in, put in some stairs, walk up them as we place them in. Uh, now uh, comes the tricky part. Well, it's not that tricky, but it's a little bit tricky. Just put in the wiring parts. Block above that to continue the pulse. Two out, two there. Uh, piston facing uh, piston facing inwards right here. Oh, hold on. There we go. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. It's too far away. Uh, piston right here block in front of it, block on top, two ticks, redstone, continue the pattern I guess, two ticks, more redstone, just, eh, there we go, piston, block above it, um, let's replace that glass, uh, two ticks, two of these, I'm just gonna go to the top here guys, and then you can probably get the gist of it, it's pretty, pretty simple to just copy and paste basically, uh, two ticks, redstone, up again, Sticks. redstone we actually don't need a block there for the top because we're not continuing a pulse again and yeah so this is a pretty small version but it will make us to the top there and there we, there it is now I can change all these to one tick to show you guys it does work up to this point um one tick works up about to that point uh, no higher um, I'm not sure the exact height that it stops working at but uh, as my estimate of trying this out, that seems to be about the height that it stops working. So one tick, uh, as you can see right here, is a lot faster, but uh, sometimes it doesn't work. Yeah, pretty fast. Uh, so yeah, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I'll try to make it as short as possible. Um, hope you guys can use this new piston door. Uh, piston door. I am into piston doors. Um, piston elevator. I hope you can use this piston elevator to your advantage. Um, make it um, work. Um, I would like to know 
um, what exactly is the level that one tick stops working at that would be awesome but I'm just too lazy to find out uh, so sorry if that was that uh, if you guys would would have uh, if it would have helped uh, for you to know that um, but anyway guys that is a piston elevator uh, the tornado style I um, hope you guys enjoyed the video so yeah like subscribe comment and all that other good stuff and yeah guys so till next time I will see you later <laughs>